Uh, so clean the washroom. <clears throat> okay. Clement Weathers. Uh, you know a lot of folk have asked me recently, Clem, why the heck you buy a huge abandoned washroom where you only gotta need it when you gotta only gonna need it six to eight times a day? I'll tell you, I'm gonna convert it into a Muckingham's premier nightclub, Young and Scrape Novelty, right? And I can tell you ain't no one around here drunk pina coladas out of your urinal. I can tell you that. Anyway, I'm a bit of a germaphobe myself, so I, I only got as far as taking the cubicle doors off. But you could blast the place. I'm, uh, I can see what, so I can see what I'm playing with. We have to clean a washroom, a bathroom, I guess. Well, it is British, so yeah, a, a, a water closet. Yeah, let's clean a water closet. Why not? Oh my god, I'm hating this so much. I've been sick for about three days. And I'm kind of coming down from it. Before that, I was doing a jigsaw puzzle for like a week straight. We have this uh, 3,000 piece jigsaw puzzle from Ravensburg that we've just been working on in our spare time. <clears throat> oh god. Okay, let's walk through the area first. Oh boy. That's just funny. Okay. And then the other door. How bad of an area are we dealing with here? Okay, we need a heavy. Let's get rid of the long, let's go for... Let's get the short, let's get... Oh god, uh, yeah. It's been a little while since I've played this game last. Why is this guy wanting to set up a... This guy actually wants to set up a nightclub. At least the light cleans off easily. Light clean, cool, good. The light's clean. Yeah, I only have about two hours to like stream right now. Cause it's four in the morning. I don't like this guy's plan, though. I wonder what the lore is gonna do with this, like... Oh yeah, that guy has a washroom. For some reason, he converted into a different thing entirely. I know I'm doing this at like ass o'clock in the morning. I'm not expecting anyone to show up and watch this. And I'm okay with that. I actually just felt like streaming. Jay's behind me asleep. Most of my friends are probably asleep right now. At least the ones that live in the United States and the ones that live in Australia. Well, they're probably doing their own thing anyway. 
which is all good. Door, door frame. You turn around and you see the hell that awaits. I've actually got like 30 or 40 games to play right now that like I've lined up and just have not had the chance to actually like work's been absolute hell so I've not had a chance to stop Is this part of the... Okay, so this isn't part of the tunnel wall. That... Oh, God. Okay. Okay, so I need to go by... Cleaning liquid, which go figure. Go back to the shop. Power washers, nope. Uh, equipment. Where is the extra long for the urban? Do I want to buy some skins? I have metal cleaner. Oh, this is just, oh God. Oh, great. I, I didn't realize this is a... This is the urinal. Okay. No, I would not drink out of this. Not I would not drink someone's piss out of that. Thank you, but no thank you. what they've done with this game. This game is quite fun with what they've done. There's a lore built into this very like calming thing. You can put up pretty much any music you want behind this game and just play it without any obligation. No music sounds out of place with it on. Though this is disgusting. This feels just like um, the playground episode. So, this is the first one I think that's like actually fully indoors.
Good. Just clean it straight. Good. Good, good, good. Oh, that's not even doing anything. It has to be this one. Okay, let's just finish up this room here. That's about all this week's been, it's like, sneezing, coughing, sneezing, coughing, sneezing, sneezing, sneezing. Ugh. And then doing puzzles in the middle of it, it's been great. I actually had to, uh, for the first time in a long time, I called out from work today. So I felt like shit earlier. Just, just called out, it was weird. I felt horrible. I don't know how to feel about feeling horrible, but whatever. Can we be done with this wall yet? Oh my god, why- what? Oh god, that was bright. That was fucking bright. Cool. This one doesn't seem like it would take actually a long time to do. It just seems like a lot of like just dirt and grime and disgustingness all in one place. And all of that. Service to require back at the carnival in order to redress the scales of justice. Okay. Into the main room where each of the sinks is covered into a co cocktail maker, each following a different recipe. No! Stop telling us this stuff. That's disgusting. Why? Why would you do this? Was that about deepest base? I lost my shit at that. I lost my shit at deepest base beats. Oh my god. Yeah, I lost my shit at that part. That was the thing I lost it at. There's 14 lights in this room. Okay, each wall is treated as its own individual wall.
Oh, there it is. Okay, cool. Slowly but surely work our way through this hallway. Actually, I've been watching a, uh, a YouTube channel recently. All about how to beat different, like, horror movies or different, like, death game horror movies. All because Squid Game's out now. And, like, apparently some channels have been taking advantage of the fact that, like, death games are back in the... Back in the social consciousness, I guess. And, like, there's a channel that's just dedicated to talking about... How to survive those death games. Like, what's the best strategy? What's the survival strategy to get through them? And they're always like, Oh man, in this movie, if you had just been, like, super observant, you would have realized that this person isn't lying, or, like, this is the optimal thing to do. I feel like Saul, the Saul series moves might be the worst out of all of them. As far as, like people just being unobservant. <clears throat> I think it was, uh, I've actually never seen the Saw series, but like, because I don't like horror movies. But I think one of them was like, the way you would have solved the puzzle is just like, once you get through the puzzle and you survive it, you're supposed to enter the next room. And the people enter the next room, and of course, every room they've gone through previously, the door has shut on them. And you look through this, you, there's three people still alive in this, in this video, in this uh, movie, at this point. And every single previous door they've walked through before immediately closes on them. And they look into this room, and there's definitely heavy stuff in the next room. And instead of, like, one person going in and getting that heavy equipment, all three of them walk into the room, let the door close behind them, and look around and realize there's heavy equipment. But they could have just rammed into the door so they could just back up the moment, like, things went sour. There's another scene like there's hay bales in the room and then like, if you just look in the room it's obvious that there's like a window up top that they could have easily just taken all the hay bales and like got up to if they had just looked around for two seconds. But apparently no one in that universe knows how to be observant. Oh man, we survived this one death trial. Let's go through more of them. So there's, oh, there's a window up there. Also, don't just assume that every like Everything is exactly the way it seems. Especially when the guy, in those movies, because it's Jigsaw you're fighting against, the guy very p carefully picks his words. And you would think after, like, everything that everyone in that universe knows about the killer, he's very specific about the, the words he uses. So if he says, oh, there's a key to your future, and then he, like, hands you a shotgun shell and a shotgun... There might be, like, something up with that shotgun. Maybe don't just fire it first things first. 
If Jigsaw says, just walk away, maybe just walk away. But yeah, everyone's just like so into themselves that they can't like stop for two seconds to like think about the situations they're walking into and it gets them killed like every time. Metal? Ah, oh, god damn it, metal. Uh My worst enemy, metal. Oh, that whole thing's metal too? Really? Oh, that sucks. No, I'm not going to do that for every single one. Oh boy, further along the cubicles. Look dude, you have my attention. I want to know what's going on with this place. There will be private dance floors, each one featuring latest hits from a different continent. What the fuck? Okay. It's gonna suck when this guy finds out about copyright. Okay, so I still need what metal cleaner? Yes. others? Oh, no, I only have point one left. Is there more metal cleaner? Yes, there's a lot more metal cleaner. Good. Like four whole bottles.
What the fuck? Okay, whatever. There's a cistern. I looked up and I was like, why the fuck is there- Oh. Pie box that I didn't see before. I've never seen a urinal with a urinal topper on it. That's a really weird concept. I'm a little concerned and a little confused. We got the skylight frame clean. That's not, not that bad. Could have been worse. Put the multi-purpose cleaner on it. that once it has the multi-purpose cleaner on it it's just like okay yep it uh it cleans this except for this thing over here or the multi-surface cleaner it's like it cleans only these things you can tell exactly where it runs out Yeah, the moment it runs out, it's like, oh, this water can't clean anything ever again. This is all it can clean is this thing right here. And then it's like, yeah, but it's still water. It's still coming out at a pretty high rate of speed.
Oh god, we've only done half of this. This half still looks like absolute garbage. We've basically cleaned this room. Yeah, we've basically cleaned this room. Except for the ceiling. I'm actually really happy this thing came. Oh god, now what, what? The urinals now I'm thinking will contain each need a different spirit, uh, spirit or mixer allowing the patrons to experience crafting your own cocktails. Don't. Don't allow your patrons to mix their own stuff. That's how you wind up with lawsuits from people who are like, why didn't you tell me this was mixing a bad thing? If they get sick on their own time, that's their business. If they get sick at your location, that's your business. Ever fucking do that. I mean, I know it's like, you, know, you knew what you were getting into, like walking into this establishment and everything. But still, that's a lawsuit waiting to happen. Oh, I can mix my own spirits and liquors? Yeah, I'll, I'll be fine. I know my own limit. Yep, that's what it is. I definitely won't abuse this alcohol in any kind of way. I still love that the water like forgets that it's water. The water's just like, oh yeah, I was water, and now I'm not. Yeah, I'm glad that this game, like, came out with another update. I like this game for the fact that, like, you don't expect a game with the premise of you're just a dude who, minding his own business, just trying to clean shit up. It's all you're trying to do to turn into, oh yeah, by the way, the mayor of this town might be a corrupt person, and oh, all these things are happening. Oh, there's a murder mystery also happening in the background. Oh, there's all this stuff. And you're just there, like, just trying to clean up the world around you.
That's a plot line right there. Yep, all this shit's going on around me. Well, I got a job at like 5.30 today. God, that's gonna... Sucks about the mayor and everything, but I got a job later at his house, so, uh, yeah. Something about his boat or something? Yeah, you're just, that's the way that you are. You're just doing business. Normal ass dude doing normal ass work. Archways, why not? The bay, oh, the sinks. I was like, basins, sinks, okay. British game, British mannerisms. The words basins instead of sinks for some reason. That dirt just, oh, I forgot I have the highlighter on. I was like, why did the dirt just disappear? Forty-seven minutes of this. Sixty-eight percent done. God, that is just disgusting, though. This room. This room, which we're about to have to clean, is disgusting. I like that they still call it a toilet. Instead of, like, a bog or something. Let me get finished with one side of the room, I guess, before I start on this other crazy side. I 
Also, why us? Why did we get stuck cleaning up a cleaning up a urinal and like cleaning up this entire bathroom? Most bathrooms you don't need to do this to. I don't want to go in the shit room. I do not want to go in the shit room. Not yet. It's not time for the shit room. Get this out. That is absolutely disgusting. Like, if you want to look up the lore for this area, you go for it. I am not sitting around in this shithole to look up the lore for all the individual, like, references in this one room. This is too much. Never put your Easter eggs in the shitter. Good. We we got the lid clean. Just perfect. Oh my god. Oh. What the fuck? What the fuck game? You know, we've cleaned some really disgusting things in this game. The skate park, the playground. You know, when I started playing this game, I didn't think one of them would be a literal bathroom. So that toilet is not all-purpose. It's closer to, like, glass. I know it's an all-purpose cleaner, but... You do it what you can get. Oh god, I'm stuck under something. Good, we clean. Clean that. It's always good. Also, I don't like that I can't jump on top of the toilet itself.
at some point, did the jumping in this game get broken or nerfed or something? Because I distinctly remember like jumping higher or whatever. Still have one more sink to clean? Which one? That one? Just a quick clean over the floor. Good. Enjoy the music. I don't know how much you, if you can hear as we play the game, but enjoy whatever I decided to put on. I know it's copyright free, but uh, I think it's lo-fi hip hop. Which I don't know why that's the thing I decided to put on, but whatever. I don't have enough money, bot, um, energy. It, or apparently, like, ability to speak uh, to care. Anything else on this side? No? Cool. Except for that one room. Wash them all, wash them all, oop. 
Must make sure washroom wall is clean. I'm actually just enjoying this game. I don't, that's why I'm not saying much. I'm not feeling well. I'm playing a chill, relaxing game. And I'm just cleaning stuff. This is probably gonna be the only like level I do on this stream. We're probably gonna end after this. I just wanted to just, just stream really quickly. Do a short stream. Really, really short stream. Without any kind of obligation. Yes, it's coming up nice, right? Good, yes, correct. I don't know why you're asking us, but yes, sure. Expecting holes in the walls and all the manner of unholy deposits. Man, you have some, like, faith in your shitters, I guess. I need too much of this crack tie. Are you in here with us? Are we wearing one of those headsets where he can see what we see? It's always in the most, like, wherever spot, and you're never sure where it is. Okay, I was just blind for that one. Everything is clean from one specific angle. Anything else? The ceiling. God damn it.
good. Good, 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 good. Oh, God. All that's left is these rooms, right? There's definitely a face in that corner. Also, there's a, uh, oh god, what are these called? Um, th it's Kilroy. There's a Kilroy in this bathroom. I don't know why there's a Kilroy in this bathroom, but there's a Kilroy in this bathroom. typically supposed to put those in like normal people areas you're supposed to put them in super hard to reach areas last time I checked then again the Kilroys were like in the 80s so I couldn't really tell you why there's a why there's one in this game I guess references be references might as well get all the like the old memes in here while you still have a chance to do what else is left <clears throat> four more cistern pipes three more tiled floors concrete floor trim there's two of them okay that's one Two. Cool. We did that. That was easy. <clears throat> Cisterns. Any over here? Either one of those. No? Good. Oh, uh, the pricing for, uh, so about a week, week and a half ago, Nintendo did a direct that was stating, hey, by the way, here's all our stuff for, like, December this year. Oh, yeah, by the way, we're also releasing a Nintendo, uh, Nintendo Switch Online. We're adding N64 and uh, Sega Genesis capability. And we're going to release what date, what the prices are at a later date. Since, you know, it's a bit more extra and, you know, a little extra functionality. So they released the prices today. Normally, Nintendo Switch Online is like 20 bucks a year, something like that. For a single membership and it's like 50 bucks online for a year. But it's like $5.99 a month otherwise. That'd be two ninety nine. I forget how much it is. I buy it per three months, and it's like seven, eight bucks for three months. Well, they released the new update, the new like new price points for if you want to get the new stuff, and it's like it's fifty dollars a year if you want the fa the the regular edition. It's eighty dollars a year if you want to get the family. So it's like hell. I'll just get the family and share it with all my friends. That seems a bit much. 
don't get me wrong, I love, I love N64 games. Some of my first, like, games ever. But even I recognize scalping. Even I recognize, like, price fixing. Even I recognize, like, scarcity and demand. And, like, Nintendo trying to do that is just kind of... Makes me feel bad for a company I actually like. It's like, why, why did they, you don't have enough money already? So, I was like, I'll just, I'll get the, I'll get the family pack for all my friends. And then I decided, you know what, maybe I'll just build a, a retro pie. And just emulate all that stuff. I own almost all the games for the N64 anyway. So for me to like emulate it would not be hard. And it would be completely legal for me to do. I own the hardware. I own all the software for it. The only thing I don't own is the BIOS, so I just were to dump that on my own, technically. I own that specific version of the BIOS, even though I can't, like, release it or leak it out to the public. I would just be creating a copy of a thing I already own, with, as long as I don't share it with anyone. So I'd be clear as far as copyright was concerned. There was a thing in here that definitely had, like, a small amount of dirt on it. Two more. Let's just clean what we can from the outside.
Actually, we haven't got done with this one. Let's get done with the one and then we can go on to the next. Is it fully connected to this one? It is. Okay, that's why. So this is the last room. Okay, cool. Okay, this is toilet face. Good. Just casually cleaning the toilet as one does on a Saturday morning. Ah, yes. Best pastime. What I like to do wake up. Big old bowl of corn bran or corn flakes and clean a toilet. You know, the American way. Try to mute as fast as I could, but there's no, there's no muting for that. It just hurts. Slowly but surely, getting everything done. What else is left to clean? One more cistern pipe. No. That one. No. Hey, look at that.
Come on, I just need the one more percentage point, wherever it is. Unless this is the same. The ceiling panel is like the one in here. No, it's not. This one is a different one entirely. Fuck, I don't know where that one was. door frames that one okay oh well yeah that would do it and that would definitely do it door hinges lights Two lights that are not clean. Okay, <clears throat> lights. Light conduits. Ceiling panel, toilet, urinal, ledge. Ceiling panel. What ceiling panels left? Oh god, it's in that it's in that corner. Can't believe this is the same place that I brought bought your miracle workers that you What? The fuck did I just read? I believe it's the same place I bought. You're a miracle worker. Is that what you are? Is what you are. Now I'm thinking, do I really want a bunch of sweaty Gen Z's grinding up the place? Or do I want to open up a luxury washroom where you spend a penny in peace and bet at a higher price? Hmm. It does appeal. I'm glad that I know what spend a penny means. Also, at a higher price, do you charge for washrooms? 
Is that a thing? I know what spin a... I also know why it's called spin a penny. So yes, I do know you do pay at certain washrooms in the UK. Especially back in the old days. I do know that. Oh, the Helter Skelter. That's going to be a next time. 